A560 comes with BIM A flight controller. It can be controlled by different kinds of transmitters. Today I'm going to introduce how to set TAFB to operate A560. You can also check this tutorial for how to use TAFB with BIM A flight controller. A560 RTF version comes with R8XM receiver. R8XM receiver is compatible with TAFB transmitter. So we can use RHXM mini receiver and TAFB together. Here is BIM A flight controller. Aileron server is connected to channel 1, elevator server to channel 2, and the throttle ESC to channel 3, rudder to channel 4, and the bus or PPM channel is connected to receiver RHXM here and make sure the polarity is not reversed here in the right connection. Now power on TAMB transmitter and also A560. I have already finished bending between TAMB transmitter and R8 XF receiver. So there is Sony the light of the receiver. And we can see the LED of R8 XM is blue or purple, which means it is bus working mode. Uh, BIM A supports standard bus or PPM signal. So make sure the receiver is in bus or PPM working mode. Power it off. Now set the transmitter. If you are using TAFB and the TAS transmitter, you can download and install Parameter Setup app on your phone to adjust the parameters. Here is the app for iPhone. Click and open it. Connect. Radio link. and the transmitter will beep. Push any one of the trim button to confirm the collection. And we can see now they are connected. And click basic menu. Reverse. Set the direction of channel 3 to reverse. REV and set the direction of other channels to normal, norm. And when using transmitters from other brands, there is no need to follow this requirement. And then the flight modes of BIM A flight controller are controlled by channel 5 and channel 7. Promix System when using TAB transmitter, the flight modes are switched by switch B, channel 5, and switch A, channel 7, by default. And uh, these two switches, switch A and the switch B. Return to the server display. And we can see channel 5 is controlled by a three position switch, switch B. And channel 7 is controlled by a two position switch, switch A. After setting the transmitter power on A560, The self-check of BIM A is done, and let's make attitude calibration. Place A560 on the ground to calibrate the attitude, and it is advised to lift the head of A560 with about 20 degree angle for beginners to calibrate it. And now calibrate the attitude, and please pay attention that R8XM receiver has two antennas, so please do not keep A560 too close to the transmitter 
because it may cause a signal block. And to keep the distance more than 60 centimeters when calibrated. Push two drone sticks like this. And the LED will bind A will flash once, and it is also normal that the control surface of A560 swing and also the motor rotate once. And then I will introduce the flight mode of bind A. Bind A V2.0 has six flight modes. We have already assigned the switch B and the switch A to switch flight modes and refer to the picture on the screen. Push switch A up. It is stabilized mode when switch B up. General mode when switch B central and manual mode when switch B down. In manual mode, there is no general function, so the control service won't loop when you turn the aircraft. Push switch A down. It is multi-rotor vertical mode when switch B up. Acrobat mode when switch B central. And the fixed wing vertical mode when switch B down. The value range of channel 5 and channel 7 corresponding to the flight mode is shown in the picture. When using transmitters from other brands, please refer to it to switch the flight modes. And now test general phase. Switch to stabilize mode. Push switch A up and also switch B up. It is stabilized mode. Hold A560 and turn it to check the movement of the control service of aileron. Elevator, a rudder. If the gyro phase is reversed, please press the bending button on line A to change the gyro. Here it is. And then test transmitter phase. Switch to manual mode. Push switch A up and the switch be down. It is manual mode now. Push the joystick of aileron. And the beta. And rather. Check the movement of the control service. If the movement of the control service of the corresponding channel is reversed, Enter the setting page of the transmitter to adjust the transmitter phase and the corresponding channel. After you have done all the above preparations, you can install the propeller and fly A560 outside.